will be a play. I am back today here with another video, and today I am going to see if I can beat Sonic the Hedgehog 2 without collecting a single ring. Boop, boop. Now, this is going to be hard. The rules are simple. I cannot beat a ring, or I can't get a ring, and I have to try to beat every level in the game doing it. I just want to see how far I can get. Not doing that. Now, <clears throat> I you can hear me fine right now, but whenever the volume goes, it's way louder than me. So I don't want to speak whenever it's blurring audio. Alright, so let's get started. So, pretty much you already know how this works. I can't get any rings. It's extremely simple. You know, some something new I thought I'd try. Something I don't think anybody's really tried to do yet. So, I'm going to go on a no save. I'm going to pick. Now, here's the thing. If you have Tails with you, and he gets a ring, I think it adds to your ring count, which won't count. So, we need to do it with only Sonic. Alright. I had some lag there. I don't know if you guys saw that. It's kind of slow. Alright, so here we are. Okay, so the very first level, um, we are brought here with. Okay, I'm gonna turn that off. Okay, so, so now you guys can hear me, okay? I'm just gonna put some background music here, probably. Shields are allowed. Oh, so I've gotten a ring. So every time I get a ring, I have to restart the game. <clears throat> so, which can also be kind of hard because, um, yeah, look, if you get hit one time without a ring, then you lose a life. So that's another really hard thing about this challenge. So I pretty much just gotta go and hope for the best of luck whenever it comes to- No! Mm. I can't restart. Great. See you guys in- Alright, let's warm up a little bit. Alright, we're ready to go. We did some crouches. And now we're ready to try and take on this level yet again. Okay. No, you don't. You gotta be very specific with your movements to not pick up any rings. Alright. So I'm gonna spin dash here, but then stop. For the off chance that I might run into some rings. Um. Okay. Alright. We're doing okay. I do not want to go on that spring. In case... No, 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 oh, I was so, I was doing so good. Oh, no. Oh, you can't restart when you have one life. All right. Let's do this again. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. Do not, do not even think about collecting one single ring. Don't do it. Please get that box. No, 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 you don't. You gotta be so specific with what you're doing. Oh my gosh. And this shield is the only source of protection I have since I can't grab any rings. So pretty much shields. Wait, are you... Wait, are you kidding me? 
I was pressing back the entire time while falling through the air, and I still fell down here and got these rings. Okay, that that's like literally just to be unfair. Emerald Hill is already is already like impossible. <clears throat> Do this again. One life left. Let's pointlessly try once again to play Emerald Hill Zone without grabbing a ring. Alright. No, 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 you don't. Now, apparently, if I'm not so precise with these jumps on the platforms, I'll go all the way over to the right, even though I'm pressing over to the left, and then... I'll get so many rings. Is it even possible to beat a Sonic game without grabbing a ring? Well, you know, I guess that's what we're here for today. There's absolutely no way I'm bouncing on... This is a bad situation. If I bounce on that, it's sure to take me and bounce me into some rings. And jumping down there, if I'm not precise enough with my jump, I could hit that 10 ring box or monitor. So I'm gonna have to jump down here. And pray, yep, that there is no rings. I got lucky. And now my luck has instantly ended. I think this is impossible. To get past without getting the ring, so there's no choice but to retreat and try to see if it's possible for me to take the opposite route. Um, or like, get get back to where I came from so I can get, so I can go back the other route. But instantly, I met with those same rings up that hill. Got a... Hmm... I guess I wasn't good enough at that. Instantly lost my source of protection. In other words, this run is pretty much already done. Can't touch a single enemy, otherwise I'm doomed. Jump. I pressed jump! I was spamming jump over and over and over again. You know what, it might as well not even matter. This is impossible. My gosh, it was about to do that thing where it made me keep pressing left and I would and I would go into the rings anyway. Man, I love this app, but it is so broken. You know, I'm just gonna bounce on here. In the slight hopes, yep. There is, there is no other possible way to take a new, another route. I'm literally stuck with only these two. I could take the bottom, or the top. The bottom is impossible to do because eventually it takes you to a ramp where you have to get rings to continue the level. Um, I'm starting to think that this one is impossible too. I am not even going to count that. Because it literally did that. Because it literally did the stupid thing. Where, no, and I might as well count it. I just want to see if there's rings when I bounce on this. But of course, not even that can happen. It's not allowed. Hmm. Alright. Now, let's try. Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? It didn't even lead into... Oh, well, it doesn't matter. It's instantly impossible. Mm. Okay. Maybe if I take this, I can go fast enough to jump over it. Okay, I still want to see if it's possible, though. Alright. <clears throat> and that's it. So. 
I did the best I possibly could. I made it the farthest I even can. So, can I defeat Sonic the Hedgehog 2 without collecting a single ring? No, absolutely not, and neither can you, because guess what? It's not humanly possible. You can't you can't beat the whole game without collecting a single ring, because no matter which route you take, at some point you're gonna need to be forced to collect at least one ring to continue the game. But nonetheless, for your entertainment, I'd like to torture myself some more and try to play and try to play some of the other levels and see if maybe I could defeat those without collecting a ring. So let's move on to Act 2 of Emerald Hill Why Not. So, now let's see if it's possible to beat Emerald Hill Act 2 without collecting a ring. Now, I do think the bottom route can be skipped. How many rings are here? Four. These can definitely be jumped over. See, look, it was doing it right there. I'm trying to press right, and it made me, and it's, and it made me just, that doesn't count, no, I hit the bottom of the spring. Whatever, we're only just starting, let's restart. This is definitely doable. There are just four rings, I can jump over them. See, look, see, 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 see. Um, first of all, you gotta get out of here. Second of all, there's no way that this is possible. Is it? I don't know, maybe I could jump high enough. Oh, I can! Oh, I can jump high enough. Um, I wanna, no you don't. Going too fast can possibly result in collecting a ring accidentally, so I'm not gonna get that box. Ugh, got you. Um, okay. So, I'm able to jump here. I cannot go on that. But I can just jump up here, right? I can go like this. Oh. But that's not any better because I'm instantly met with an impossible jump. That was close. Alright. Another easy jump. Easy does it. Not too fast. Don't want to accidentally get a um, uh, ring. I don't think loop de loops are passable without collecting a ring. If I can go back, I'm gonna try the other route. Whoa! I gotta be careful because I could be one hit killed anywhere. Alright, so, um. I'm gonna take the bottom route. Wait a second. But the bottom route requires you to go up there, doesn't it? I think it does, but. Just because I'm not. Yes, it absolutely does. Uh, should I take the speed shoes? Well, jumping over that, yeah, it's 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 really quite clear that that just loops, yeah, right down there. <clears throat> okay. Um, uh, are the speed shoes? Could the speed shoes be a use to me? I could probably make the big jump with the three rings over the spikes if I have the speed shoes. So I think they're really the only thing to go with. Mm -hmm. So, I'm gonna get that. But, I still have to be extremely careful. Because, um... Yep. That jump is... That jump is impossible. So, that is declared as a fail. Both Emerald Hill Acts 1 and 2 are not possible to defeat without collecting a ring. At least, I'm pretty sure that there's no way that jump can be made without collecting a single ring. So, let's just quickly zoom through this and go on to Chemical Plant Zone. We are at Chemical Plant Zone. So, this is the last level I'll be able to try to, to try and not get any rings in, which I instantly failed on anyway, because of time.
but I mean, first of all, we have to see if it's possible to get past without a ring, because I mean, so far, um, we've had none that are possible, so, um, I at least want to try and find one that's possible well, before. I had another annoying ad that I had to shut down the game for, and... And I've collected that same one ring up there like th like three times. So if I get that ring again, I'm just going to end the video. So let's hope that that doesn't happen. It didn't happen. We've gotten very lucky today. No, no, no. I'm not even going to take it fast at all. There is no rings in here. There is a 10 ring box up there. But I know that there is hula hoops down this way. So I'm going to have to take this topper route upper root what is wrong with my english not topper root what's wrong with me no 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 i know there are rings here there has to be rings on a ramp right okay no all right oh 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 I was i wasn't gonna i wasn't gonna give up on the fact that there that there was for sure gonna be some rings here okay this looks like an absurd jump one that I don't know if, if it is possible, but yeah, that's definitely a mistake. Okay, um, since I have no rings, I'm gonna go down and try and take the lower route. So, technically, that doesn't count because my rings were instantly taken away. So, I'm gonna come down here and try this route. To see if I can do it because I already know for a guaranteed fact that that jump is not well jumpable so yep and here it is the hula hoops you cannot or no haha I'm always all right I lost the rank doesn't count Hey, what, 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 what? I thought, I thought that I lost that ring. Eh, that's not what it's about. It's if you don't collect a ring. I'm gonna have to count it as a fail and redo that. But anyway, guys, that's gonna do it. I tried some more, and then um, I did some more levels that you guys didn't see, but, um, it turns out that even if I did take the route that I was going for, I still would have ended up getting some rings nonetheless, so, um... It turns out that chemical plant act line is also not possible. So, um, today we had some fun. We tried to, um, uh, try to beat Sonic the Hedgehog 2 without collecting a single ring. Obviously not possible, but I still had fun trying. Let me know in the comment section if you'd want to see more videos like this one. I always have fun making them. Um, well, I'm going, I'm about to go and edit this video now so you guys can see it. And yeah, I guess other than that, guys, I will just be seeing you later.